What is up good people? Welcome back to another video. You've clicked on Gotham Cinnabites. I'm Terry. I appreciate you watching. Um, hadn't planned on doing this, but um, got some more stands in. So I figured I would unbox them for you. So that we can get first reactions together. Um, and while I'm opening these things, I just gotta go ahead and talk about... <sighs> Something I found out about yesterday, and that's the Candyman statue by PCS. So, got my Crippler scissors. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and unbox this. And this is what I ordered two more. And I'm sure you'll see in the thumbnail which two those are. But uh, yeah, I already got the CGCs out of the closet too, so we can see what they look like. But uh, if you don't know, I already have. A couple of videos on the channel from the Red Wolf. I will be sure to plug them and uh, get their website and every other info. Um, I know I talk a lot of shit, but I mean, the shipping crisis. Um, Devastator and the Murder Machine are coming home 100%, but it's going to depend on the price for Harley. So I know I've already bit the bullet and bought the comic, but uh, that, that, that doesn't mean the statue is, is, is 100, 100%. So, uh, so we'll see. Hopefully the shipping thing goes as quick as it's coming. But uh, yeah, see, that's what you, that's what you see. Mm. It's a Candyman by PCS. I was told by a few people that we were going to get one quarter scale and one third scale. And the teaser came yesterday. So, uh, the one third is coming. But I don't, I don't know why I was honestly thinking it was going to come at the same time. But, uh, my biggest fear, I guess, is that I'm afraid I'm going to like the one third better, but no room for one third and then I started thinking well murder machine's gonna have to go there one day so maybe I can put Batman damned up there and then like a one third candy man on that side kind of the same part of the shelf maybe that'll look okay and uh, if it's gonna be one third I really hope it's a small base like their blade and their uh, storm so but we'll see. Um, he's going to be at Comic Con in San Diego next week. Um, friend of the channel, the one that's helping me do the giveaway, Casual Nerd Problems, Steve. He's going to be there. And during Toy Quest's um, interview last night with Ant, it's confirmed that. Uh, He's going to be there, and Candyman's going to be there. So I reached out to Steve, and you best believe sometime next weekend, hopefully, depending on how quickly he gets the pictures, which which no rush, dude. We're going to have a uh, Gotham Gavel coming on the one third PCS Candyman. All right. So I can see through this already. It's glorious. This one. that little thing y'all got going on back here. That little red wolf tag. It's my first one getting one with that on there. Nice touch, guys. Yeah. And don't worry, I'm going to be doing close-ups. But, uh, you got your little 3D murder machine. My God, it's so badass. And then, of course, you got purple. Which it, you're like, why purple? Why purple? You'll see when I pull out that CGC. The murder machine. I love this thing, guys. I love it. Old Red Wolf logo for you. Right. So I'm gonna put this on the shelf. Oh man, I'm gone. Where am I? You can't see me. Oh man. Come on, we don't want to be like John Cena. 
All right, we're back. So I'm gonna put this one right over here, and again, I'm gonna get y'all close-ups with the CGC inside of it. Yes, I'm not like Mr. X. I'm wearing pants. <laughs> and they all come with these backs, in case you just wanna display, you know, a comic, not just a comic stand. But we're gonna put this one right here for now. And we're gonna actually get this. Oh, they want a CD. Alright, so here that is. And you see, and you'll see definitely in the close ups. This book has a purple sheen to it. And although I love it, I love the logo, this little bastard, that's all the murder machine we. Oh, I'm right up against the mic. That's all the murder machine we get. So. You can see most of these statues are direct interpretations of these covers. So you can see I'm, I was afraid of what that statue was going to look like. But I'm blown away by, what it, by how it came out. Really, I am. Alright. Mess with that later. Alright. So we talked about Candyman. Oh, damn. They unboxed Murder Machine. Alright. Let's get that great big bastard out, right? And you guys, uh, I know you've probably seen a teaser on the Instagram, and I don't know if I shared it on Facebook or not. But, um, I'm in the middle of a huge, uh, work stretch so uh, next weekend today is Saturday <laughs> get those days when you work so many in a row so by uh, next weekend I'm definitely going to clean the entire collection and install some lights and uh, hopefully by the end of next weekend I'm also going to do another, another room tour for the mid-year because the drowned is new, Lister is new, yeah. And plus, I may go ahead and move Batman Damned up top now during the cleaning and set these new CGCs just kind of in his gap or his void. But uh, so yeah, sometime in the next couple weeks you're gonna see uh, a room tour, mid-year room tour, and definitely gonna. Be doing these metal videos with the wife and holy shit. <sighs> so awesome. Now with this one, all of my logos on the sides were 3D um, versions of the logo. But Devastator having such a weird a weird logo. Actually my Grim Knight is like this too. Because I, I didn't have a bad logo for Grim Knight. I think I just put the Batman Who Laughs symbol on here. But yeah, so that's Devastator's symbol. Which, I mean, that's still badass. It does the job. But then you got... Look at that sweet thing. Yeah. Nice touch with the burnt orange. And again with the... Red Wolf's logo. It's pretty cool, guys. It's pretty cool. So I'm gonna set this one right there. And yeah, well, let's get you to this book out too, right? These books are finally out. And gosh, they're all 9.4, 9.6, 9.8. This is my lowest one, 9.0. But I didn't buy it for the grade. Just see him in all his devastating glory. So yeah, I got everybody out now. Just need the statues prime one. <laughs> all right, so that is going to do it for this portion. Um, yes, I guess we'll end um, some dubbed over, uh, well lit close ups. But yeah, look for uh, look for that. Um, Updated um, lighting, room tour, mid-year, that's coming. Um, 
We're gonna do a Gotham gavel on the one third Candyman when I get those pics from Steve. Um, yeah, and then the metal videos with the wife. We had intentionally, or I'm sorry, we had at first planned on going through the Saul movies this year like we did Hellraiser last year. But I think we're gonna pause on that and hopefully do that next year because uh, just the way things are going with Lily, I think it would be uh, just less stressful just let her be one more year old. But, um, yeah, me and, me and Liam are probably gonna go see that new Turtle movie by Seth Rogen. And then I am going to go see Blue Beetle, so I am going to do those um, movie discussion videos. So yeah, that's that's what's all in the computer right now. That's what's coming. Um, so I've rambled on enough. Uh, I'm gonna get you some close-ups of these stands with these books. And guys, uh, if, you, if you like this type of content, um, hit the like button please. I really appreciate it. And um, I am doing a giveaway on the road to 500 with casual nerd problems. Um, as soon as I hit 500 on this channel, um, we're going to go live on both channels to give these five books away. Um, these four metal books I'm giving away, and Steve has been gracious enough to put up that Batman Who Laughs book. So, uh, look for that. 500 subscribers. One winner. Five books. So, uh, look forward to that. And guys, I have really rambled enough. I'm going to go get some rest while I can before the next six days. But I um, appreciate you guys making it this far. And thank you so much for watching. And uh, stick, stay tuned right now for these close-ups. And uh, as always, I'll catch you on the next one.